Good day, the good love of Ebony State. Welcome to Abakali Kip Township Stadium. It's Saturday morning. We're here to witness activities going on in the stadium where a lot of training and keep it program is been taking place. And the place is also a beautiful place. Come on, guys, let's go and have fun. So I'm here with one of the biggest clubs in Abakalki Township Stadium. Let's meet one of their head coach. Good morning, sir. Uh, my name is uh, Okechuku Alom. So what's the name of your club and what do you specialize in? Is it a dance club or a kind of fitness club? Uh, the name of my club is, uh, if you can see, at the back of the JC, Keep Fit Club at Bakaliki. We are the best in Ebony State. And we specialize on fitness. We dance, we keep fit too. Now, if someone wants to be a member of this club, how can the person get to join? Okay, if anybody wants to join the club for the first time, mm. he will first and forth register as a club member first. And we have benefits. Okay. When you are doing something, if you have any event you are doing, be it barrier, child dedication, wedding. If you invite us, we will come there to, to accompany you to whatever you are doing. So far, you invite us. It's not only just to train and go. We have other social uh, events in it. Okay. All right. That was nice for me. Thank you very much, sir. All right. I'm really enjoying what's happening here. Like, this is wow. This is nice. It has tools. Other places. I'm wondering, is there no kind of fitness club in the boys? They come to this place and I discovered that as well. A lot of this is going on here. Yes. There yes, are a lot of beautiful yes. people here. Yes, thank you. So much. <laughs> Family is one of the most beautiful and talented dance group in Ebony State. They're also training at Bakaliki Dance Shift Stadium. So let's meet with one of their leaders. My name is Michael from Ebony People TV. Hi. I've observed your people from a distance and I see they are doing well. So can you please tell me, is this a dance group or what? Yes, it's a dance academy. It's a dance academy, right? Yes, okay, so can you just tell me more about this dance academy? Well, this is Supreme Dance Academy um, slash SDA. Okay. So. We we'll start, we'll started this crew at least as, sorry, we started this academy mm. last year, June, okay. if I could remember. Though I've been doing the dance right from time, but I now bring it up like a dance academy for anybody that feel like learning how to dance. If you know whatever thing you can do, apart from, as far as dancing, mm. it's all about dancing. You're free to come and join and register. You learn different kind of dance. So that is the reason why this academy is here for anybody that is free, that thinks he or she wants to learn how to dance. Because I found out that dance is an exercise. Dance is something that when you're doing it, you just you feel more happy. Like you know, many people have something they do, but I feel like dance makes me happy. It gives me this, this so much inspiration for keeping up and teaching other people the way to learn how to dance the way I do too. Okay, that was wonderful. It's nice seeing something like this in Abakaliki. Now, do you guys go for shows or you, you just yes, dance? We go for shows. We go for shows. If they invite us for a show, we go. Even if they didn't invite us, we go for we go for some shows outside. Even outside Abakaliki, we go for shows. We come back in peace. Now, if anybody wants to join this particular dance crew, where are the procedure to join? Um, it's not much thing because you know if you're going for a, you are going to register if you're going for a school now you are going to you're supposed to register you know same way here if you want to learn how to dance you register because when you register it will give you the motivation to concentrate on what you're doing because if you do not register you take it as if it's nothing yeah what you don't pay for you don't value it yes what you didn't pay for you don't value it. so the main thing there is that you register and the registration is no more just three thousand naira okay now, lastly, do you do all type of dance or just um, break dance? Do you yes, do traditional dance? I do traditional dance. I do hip hop. I dance Afro. We dance break dance. We dance robot dance. Apart from ballet. Okay. Now, please. Lastly, can you just call your phone number so people that are interested can join you? Okay. My phone number is seven zero seven zero 
0906-6666-3590 or 090 716 You always gain this leg up. Why? This is the movable leg. This is a sport classified as an indoor game. Why some people call it an outdoor game, depending on where you are playing it from. Yeah, I am in the bad meeting court and I'm about to speak with their head coach in Ebony State. Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, my dad. We are uh, on training. Bad meeting game. Bad meeting? Yes, yeah, that is the name of the game. Oh. So, ma, there was something I was thinking. This game an outdoor game or an indoor game? Because I see some people play it indoor, why some people sure. play it outdoor? Yes, you are correct. The game is an indoor game. Indoor? Indoor. Okay. But because we don't have indoor here, so we decide to use what we call the improvise. Okay. What we are doing now, we call it improvise. Okay. So, since we don't have indoor, we cannot be waiting for the indoor. That is why we started with outdoor. Okay. Ma'am, I'm seeing you are really doing a great job. I love the way you are training these athletes. They are not children. Athletes, yeah. Yeah, athletes. So if someone wants to be among this badminton team, what are the procedures required? Yeah, like this uh, athlete you see. Yes. They are in schools. Okay. They don't, just to get your rackets mm -hmm. and your, your sports attire, we don't collect, it's the coach. We are tra training them for the, for the state. Okay. They do go out to represent the state. Okay, so yes, this so. is the youth team of badminton. Yes, Urban and state. we will have categories of them. Okay. We have the team, mm -hmm. we have the junior, we have the intermediate. Then you see the senior ones, like people that are playing for pleasure, you see, okay. you see them over there. Okay, they are, they are not in the state team, they are playing for no, pleasure. No, they, they do go for veteran. They, these are veteran team. Better, like, I'm not go, going for all this uh, active, active, you know what I mean by active. From that, junior, intermediate, senior players. Like senior. Good. Understand. These are fathers. They are just they coming to ease out their... Most business. competition are between the age of 25 downward, and I think they are above that age. Yes. The government used to sponsor us mm -hmm. for games like the youth games, the secondary school games, before we used to have primary school games, mm -hmm. then... The National Sport Festival, sponsored by the uh, state. And at times we go for championship, which the club, veteran and active badminton club at Bakliki, they do sponsor us too. Okay. Yes. Uh, you just took me to my next question, which I don't think there's a need to ask the question again, but let me just ask it. Man, do we, this team, do they participate regularly in the youth championship, youth festival? Yes, sir, we do. Even the last uh, tournament we went was last year, 2022. At the de, uh, Delta, 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 yes, a boy participated. Okay, and I, did, and I hope they did well. They tried. Thank you. Yes, I'm proud of my Thank states. you. And Mrs. Etel C. Okurafo, the head coach of a boy state. Yes. Wow, it's a pleasure, yes, thank man. Thank, thank you very much, man. Thank you. <laughs>
Okay. Now this team, did I attend um, local competition, like state competition, inter-state competition? Yeah, sometimes we participate in Southeast tournaments, interstate uh, competitions and uh, sports festivals. Wow, National Sports Festival. National Sports Festivals. That's beautiful, sir. Thank you. It's a pleasure meeting you, sir. Thank you. everybody my name is Sabani Blessing as you can see we are doing Taekwondo this is a private club owned by an individual the name of our club is Jutan Judokwa Universal Taekwondo Association of Nigeria we started since 2013 till date and we train young ones older ones middle age Taekwondo is for everybody and is good for your health and your self-confidence and your self-defense so anybody can do Taekwondo and it's for everybody. So I advise you to come one day and join us and do this wonderful sport. You are going to appreciate that. So if you want to join us, just can give me a call away. You are just calling this number 0703-029-6615. Thank you. God bless you. Among the ladies in my name, uh, we have weightlifting session and bodybuilders. Okay. Even other aerobics, like you can see these people over here, mm -hmm. they don't normally touch more of iron. Okay. Um, they are more of aerobics, little of iron. Okay. Then you have people who are mainly for iron training. Mainly for iron? Yeah. Okay, these are the addition of mobility of muscles. Yes, exactly. So anybody can just come in and join the yes, team? Yes, you are free. You're free to join. This is a public utility now. Okay. Yeah. Excuse so me, is it owned by, is it public? Is it being funded public? by the government? Or yeah, by it's private? a stadium now. It's a sports stadium. It's a public utility, though there's uh, people's contribution to make it happen. Like some of the equipment we contribute to put it together. The ones that the government will not provide, we provide for ourselves. So if anybody comes in, you register. Okay. Yeah, 5,000 naira, then 300 monthly dues. Then you have to be in your training kit with towel, with your towel, your water bottle. 5,000 naira uh, registration fee. Registration, then 300 monthly. is monthly dues. Wow. It's quite affordable. Because it's public utility. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Uh -huh. It's public, and that 5,000 is for life. Yeah. Uh -huh. so Even if you travel and come back, eventually you will continue training from where you start. So, and are they open every day or only on Saturdays? No. Monday to Saturday. Okay. Monday now, to Saturday. Now, if as in I want to register now, I'll just come here and... Yes. Then I ask for the gym... Instructor. Okay. Mm. We have some instructors, like four instructors there that take on people. Okay. Uh, like one of them there is taking over that uh, aerobics. Okay. Yeah. All right, thank you very much. It's really a pleasure. This is quite affordable. And people don't know something like this is happening here. No, they wait till the doctor will ask them to visit. <laughs> and again, people, will, people have that mindset of they have to pay as high as twenty to 40000 If you go to a hotel where they have gym, it's very expensive. But here is public utility. Everybody is free to come in here and train. Do you understand? With little money. But what is needed is your 
your efforts, yes, and commitment. You must be yeah. about it. And when you come, you see the health benefit. Nobody will tell you not to stop again. I can see yeah. it all over your body. <laughs> As you can see, it's a beautiful place to be in Abakalike Township Stadium. There are a lot of activities going down here. Even so, a spot that I don't even know exists in Ebony State. I can see them right here. So if you are somewhere around Abakalike, the state capital, come and join us here so you can do some exercise and you can be equipped with some skin. As you remember, exercise is good for the heart. Thank you very much. I see you, Mike, your favorite TV presenter. I know you like this video. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel and also share this video. Thanks for watching.